Now, be a good little baby and tell me all about this whole serial killer business. I know some stuff. Spill it, lady. For starters, I think that's why Sheriff Green doesn't want us to go in the steel mill. Oh, yeah, that's where it all went down. So you do know stuff. <gasps> and you held back, you traitor. Yeah, because I knew you'd get all like this. Hell yeah, I would. Linda, tell me about the steel mill killer. Well, that's where it all ended. But before that, there was a whole string of disappearances. Kidnappings, really. Murders. <sighs> so what was this guy's name? Maybe we should write him into the movie. Oh, um, I don't know if we... Frank Stone. Huh. So... Frank Stone was actually killing people in the steel mill? Like, our steel mill? Where we were just shooting like an hour ago? That's the theory. Frank was working at the mill, but I think it was on its last legs by then. Probably not a lot of people around. They shut it down right after. What do you think he was up to? There has to be a reason for him to kill a bunch of people, right? There was never any kind of confession, so they don't really know for sure. Someone somewhere's gotta have some idea. Well, we could always just ask Frank Stone. Huh? Crystal ball, Ouija board, what will they say? And Miss BB's hotline, the dead are just a seance away. Okay, okay. <laughs> I called Miss BB once. I tried to speak to Mary Shelley, but Miss Beebe thought that was my grandmother, so she kept going on and on about eating enough cabbage soup. <laughs> Did you get a recipe? Oh, damn. Then again, maybe it's better not to dig up old bones. If it's ancient history... Mm, people don't really like to talk about it. You do get reporters asking around sometimes. It really rubs people the wrong way. Once Sam Green became sheriff, that all died down anyway. Sheriff Green sure seems to care a heck of a lot about this. Sam Green's the one who took Stone down. Ah. Saved a little baby that day, too. Would have been the killer's next victim. Yeah, he's kind of the town hero. Huh. Interesting. Chris, what are you thinking? You guys have been so helpful answering my questions and all, but sounds like I should probably go right to the source. <laughs> what? After today, I don't think Sheriff Green's gonna want to talk to you about anything even remotely related to the mill. You never know. Good luck with that. I guess it doesn't really matter what happened at the mill since we can't finish shooting there with a busted camera. What exactly were the reporters asking about? I don't know. They're reporters. They just want to dig up dirt. They had to have been on to something if they kept coming back. What? Well, just forget about it. Everybody around here has. Except Sheriff Green. Fine. If you guys aren't interested in filling me in, I'll find someone else who is. Okay. Good luck. I guess it doesn't really matter what happened at the mill since we can't finish shooting there with a busted camera. Who are the victims? Just people, some from the town, some were never identified. The killings were random. There was no pattern. Like, how many are we talking? No one knows for sure. Because they never found the bodies. They found parts. Seriously, guys, I just want to know why you withheld all this crucial murder mill information from me until now. It wasn't relevant? There's no world in which that's true. I need to know everything. That's pretty much all I know. Same. <sighs> There's got to be more to it. You've got a library card. Look it up. Linda, can I borrow your library card? Nope. I guess it doesn't really matter what happened at the mill since we can't finish shooting there with a busted camera. Do you know what this means? That we need a new location? No, dummy. That we already have the best location. How do you... Think about it. Our movie shot in a real-life murder mill? You can't buy that kind of publicity, Buster. Oh. People are actually going to want to see this thing. We're going to be, like, 
totally famous. Okay, sure. We might get some butts in seats, but like, what if they don't like what they see? Then we just gotta make sure these last couple of scenes are gonna blow the top of their heads off. 